Where we focus most of our time is in the post-transplant care of the patients. We feel very strongly that we want to maintain a long-term relationship with these patients. Some centers will turn their patients back to the general nephrologist at six months, one year, or at some point specific to their program. We never really let go of our patients, and part of that is because we have a different perspective and a different threshold for when we should investigate a problem. We think that the general nephrologist also needs to be involved, so we want this to be a collaborative relationship with the general nephrologist because we are not going to manage their general health care, but we do want to manage any issues that come up that are pertinent to immunosuppression. I have worked other places and I feel that the relationship between the nephrologists and the surgeons here at UCSF is unique. We have a very collaborative and collegial relationship and there's a trust that is critical to the functioning of our service. So it's a really great service to be on. I mean, I find this really unique compared to some other programs. Since the inception of the program in 1964, we've done nearly 12,000 kidney transplants and are now on pace to do over 400 transplants this year. I think one thing about the culture of our program that is unique is our collaborative relationship with our surgeons. As medical director, I've tried to let people pursue their academic endeavors and develop their careers, which is important because we're not robots. I want everybody to have their unique impression on the, the service, and everybody is a little bit focused on something a little bit different and find their own niche. I think that really helps patient care too because we can refer within each other to each other within our program say, oh, we've got Dr. Weber who's become an expert in multiple myeloma and transplant. We've got somebody else that's uniquely um, suited to discuss certain medications that not everybody's as familiar with. It's a great service. So when I started uh, some 30 years ago, I think we had probably about five or six surgeons. We're now up to uh, 11 surgeons. We've had a growth in our training program as well, going from uh, one fellow a year in the surgical specialty to now four fellows uh, at, at any given time. And then the overall uh, support personnel, the nurse coordinators, the, the administrative staff ha has grown as well. We used to be in a very small space, I think with one or two clinic rooms. We now have uh, eight clinic rooms with a plan to expand to 21 rooms and have really broadened our outreach experience as well to keep up with the volume of patients that we see. We basically get referrals for about seven new patients a day, so um, it's, it's, it's been a real growth uh, in the program and a lot of uh, patients to take care of. So as a center that does a lot of kidney transplants, um, our research also focuses on developing new medications for kidney transplant as well as targeting diseases of primary kidney disease. And I think the high volume really helps with trying to make some sort of innovative changes into the kidney transplant field. Well, I think one of the things I like to think about our program is that we take on challenges. And in fact, I've suggested that our motto could be challenges welcome. We see a lot of difficult cases uh, that are uh, passed on by other centers who uh, aren't ready to take on the complexity of the case. And we welcome those cases with open arms. I think we have an incredible team here that's very innovative and very skilled and very experienced so that a lot of these difficult cases that really can't be well managed at other centers we're able to accommodate here. I'm a surgeon. I'm the plumber who puts it in. I can see the problem, but I need help. I need a lot of help in trying to figure out how to deal with these problems. The best thing about being at UCSF, for me, I've, I've felt like I'm a kid in a candy store. There are experts in immunology. There's experts in infectious disease. There's pathologists. It just runs right up the uh, ladder, and, and uh, the opportunities here have been incredible. That is really what UCSF makes it a special institution. Uh, it's, it's the collaborations that you need to make this work. So taking care of patients is really a fun part of what I do. I've been doing this now for 23 years, and some of these patients I've known since the early 19, well, since 1996 when I first started here. And I see patients in clinic that are 20 years out from transplant. And it's very exciting to see patients who are doing well 20 years out. Um, we have a relationship. Uh, they're comforted when I'm on the service if they know me because we've got this relationship. So it's actually a lot of fun to see these patients doing well. 
And I think that is again one of the benefits of being here and holding on to our patients for long term is we do have that relationship and, and we make minor adjustments and help try and prolong the uh, life of their graft.